Hey guys, welcome back to my craft room and back to Stash Dash. My goodness, this thing is so full. <laughs> I have no idea at all <laughs> what we're going to do here. We have tons of summery items. We have tons of fall items. I now have some, your Halloween items. I now have some fall in there. So we just are <laughs> rocking and rolling with the stash dash. I really should do something that will use a ton of paper. Hmm. I don't know if I have like a theme that would use up a lot of this. <laughs> I feel like there's only a few pieces of only a few different themes. Hmm. Got tons of cardstock too. Oh, this is gonna be a toughie. I'm gonna go ahead and flip it over. <laughs> I feel like there's two separate sections here. <laughs> Some of these I've been eyeballing for a while, but I don't have the exact things that I want to use with them, so <laughs> I just keep sitting. I really should just use them. That would make sense, right? Oh no. This is really cutting into the creating time. <laughs> oh yeah, we have the cruise stuff too. You know what? I like this this yellow. I wonder if we have some other kitcheny. Actually, I'll save that for the inside. Unless I have a nicer one. Ooh, that little heart. Oh, we have a big panel of the heart too. Nah. The stars would look good. Oh, there's a red. I don't know about that yet, though. Oh, there's some blue gingham stars. I uh, feel like that's not quite what I'm going for. Oh, man. These are pretty, too. <laughs> so many pretty things. Actually, the peaches would actually go pretty well with the... Eh, maybe not. We'll see. I'll pull them out, and if they don't work, they go back in. <laughs> I need, like, kitchen-y items. I do have a kitchen paper pad. No. Which I can pull out if need be. Oh, you know, I think I have some kitcheny items in my little die cut bin. I also have the new apron die that I got. But I thought I had some in here. Oh yeah, we have the <laughs> authentic confectionery in here. Okay, I think that what's this say? Happy times? That might be cute. Oops. 
bumping the camera with my glasses again. Oh, I love that paper. That always turns out so good. That beach paper. The black and white. Oh. The stickers are coming off. Oh yeah, we have some sewing. I forgot I put that in there. Some of those papers that we used for the Disney Princess. Some purples. Not really what we need. And then I think we've got all Halloween after that. Okay. Let's see what we can do with this. Let me grab my die cut bin. Uh oh. Everything's gonna start toppling. Oh yeah, I see some in there already. Oh yeah, I have those. Ouch! The ephemera pieces too. Oh, that's pretty. We might use that. Let's see here. Okay, I think we're going back to the root of the yellow. I wonder if this is an exact card base. <laughs> I'm going to just start, <laughs> start cutting and hopefully it Hopefully it fits. <laughs> and we're just going straight in with these carrots, <laughs> apparently. I like these enough that I think we're going to make the card fit to it. So now the question is, do I... Make this more. No. <laughs> Finish my own sentence. <laughs> kind of thinking adding the red. That seems like a really cute addition. Because these carrots are more along the red side than orange. So a red and yellow card. Okay. <laughs> do I want to add pink too? I would do the pink hearts. Oh, I do like that. That's kind of shocking. I didn't think I would. I was like, that's going to be way too many variables, but I like it. <laughs> got kind of a very cutesy home feel. Hmm, not quite set on that yet. I don't think I'm going to use any of these. Oh, I actually do kind of like the green in there, in there as well. Which is kind of shocking. Okay, let's go ahead and grab our card base. I feel like a shimmer card base would have been good for this one. A lot of shimmer though. <laughs> Actually, I might have one or two left. I haven't looked in a while. So now the question is, what kind of focal point are we using? Very springy. Very spring card. We do have. There's no place like home, home sweet home. That's more of like a really bright yellow, though. I don't think we'll go with that. Oh, that's cute. Do I want to... Well, we do have green from the carrot tops. 
Oh, that's so pretty. I feel like I need to add a bunny rabbit. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> we also have this. No, I like the thankful. I'm kind of wondering what if we do this as kind of a banner piece. Sticking out like this, maybe. Oh, it's so cute. Okay. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> I'm also <laughs> debating if I do want a bunny rabbit. <laughs> I feel like I might. This would be a good one if somebody gave you something from their garden. sure if I like the placement of this guy. That's better. I feel like we need something right there. Is it a gem? A set of gems? Hmm. Oh, hearts. For sure, hearts. What color, though? Oh, you know what's funny? <laughs> the carrots are actually the color variation on the carrots. I just so happened to pick the red ones. That works out. Okay, what color do we want the hearts? Do we want them to be this color or do we want them to be like a pink? Oh, you can't really see them. I guess that might be a good thing though. Yeah, I actually kind of like that. They blend in just enough, but stick out just enough. <laughs> but I like it. Okay. Oops, that's a lot. some of that glue out of there. There we go. Now I think I do want to add something on the inside. I do have a strip of this. Yeah, that'll work. Just a little added something on the inside. Let me move the camera down. You can get a good look at it. <laughs> it's got a very spring vibe to it, but I can definitely see, see it being used all year round. Oh, it's so cute. Alright guys, that is our Stash Dash card for today. I hope you guys are having a crazy day. Good crazy, not bad crazy, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys!